Hello? Oh, hey babe, I'm so sorry. I'm in the middle of a photo shoot right now. They're literally putting diamonds in the tub and everything. Like, it's gonna be iconic. I can't wait for you to see it. Okay, bitch, I'll hit you up in a little bit when I'm ready, okay? Yeah. Ho, ho, baby, what's your name? Go, go, go. It's your birthday. Pop champagne, cause we can you want that. here and welcome back to my channel today is my 21st birthday uh -huh. I'm gonna cover my face because I am a little intoxicated and I just filmed a drunk get ready with me and I don't really want to spoil too much be sure to give this video a big thumbs up and let me know what you thought about this video in the comments down below also subscribe to my channel for more 21 vlogs videos week in my life just a bunch of crazy stuff your girl is legal December 20 3rd 1998 you feel me you heard but yeah without further ado keep on watching this crazy mess can you guys read this <laughs> no i swear i'm not crazy it's this way <sighs> oh my god okay oh 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 okay there we go you guys can see that right now right why did these lights make me look so pale hold up okay ah! 21, 21, 20. Guys, my friends at school made me cupcakes. <laughs> oh, wow. Hey, what's good? Okay, so if you can't tell, I'm already a little bit tipsy because I figured I had to pregame just a little bit before starting this video or else it wouldn't be as effective. Anyway, let's see what we got here. So I took a shot of this New Amsterdam mango. Honestly, I'm a vodka girl. I don't know why. Yeah, they're all nasty, but at the end of the day, I feel like vodka is a little bit smoother going down. So yeah, I have my first shot glass ever. It says legal as 1998. So I'm gonna take another shot right now. I'm actually cringing. Then I have this. I've drinking like one fourth of this, but honestly, I don't think I want to drink anymore. It's been sitting in my fridge for a minute, and I don't know. Do, do they go bad? Because I don't know if it's supposed to taste like this or <laughs> if you don't know what this is This is called a beatbox and y'all I discovered these in Miami when I went to Rolling Loud Miami and basically This little thing contains 11.1% alcohol. It's equivalent to 3.4 mixed drinks If you're of age, I recommend you try these. They're pretty lit. They're better than Poor Loco for sure I went to the Habit earlier and I saved me some tropical tea as a chaser. So anyway, I have no room on this makeup table but i'm gonna drink a little bit of this is it supposed to taste like this i'm pretty sure i've had this one before and it didn't taste like this usually i go with the blue raspberry or pink lemonade this one's fresh watermelon i mean it literally tastes like watermelon juice but like i don't think i could finish this whole thing <laughs> and fun fact i love how i'm not even getting ready i'm literally getting ready to sit I actually take this off right after because it is 11 17 at night when i'm filming this it's not my real birthday when you're watching this it is i've never drank alone in my room i don't know if that's weird <laughs> but this is just weird for me so usually when I'm in a party setting like I'm like yeah let's drink but right now I'm like forcing myself for your pleasure so you're welcome if you can't tell by my face my two big zits I just finished finals uh -huh. okay I feel like I'm acting the same as I always do so clearly I need to stop stalling and take another shot and drink some of this all right, this is canceled for now. Love you, beatbox, but right now, ooh, doing this for you guys. I'm really not ready for all the drinking that's about to go down this next month, but cheers, I guess. Ooh! Clearly, I'm still sober if I'm able to do this. So hopefully, this will be good. I'm not trying to go crazy for this get ready with me, because like I said, I'm going to sleep after this. So cheers! Hold on, hold on, hold on. I need some music. Fun fact. How my friends get me to like take shots or chug something is if they start recording me because unless I like really can't, I'll usually just suck it up for the snack. Be contemplating if I'm ready to turn 21. All right, I'm going to just be in my own world for a minute, pretend I'm at the club to hype myself up real quick. Okay. <laughs> Let's start, shall we? Just like I've never drank alone in my room, I've never got ready under the influence. So, um, setting up, I was already a little tipsy. Alright, so I'm gonna answer some questions I did just post on my story for 
some questions, but I know in like 20 minutes, I don't know if I want to attempt to answer the questions. Keep in mind, I barely ate. I ate a small salad. I'm actually not a lightweight, surprisingly, but today I feel like one. I don't know. You know, we all have our days. Some days it takes forever. Other days it's like, whoop, that went straight to my head. Is this going to be the first time you've ever been drunk? Happy birthday, babe. <laughs> So no, it's not gonna be. Let me start my foundation. Let me stop playing. All I'm gonna say to that is I am in college, so I have had my fair share of experiences. Uh, but thank you so much, my love. I'm so excited. But don't underage drink. Please don't use this as encouragement. Sis, how do you get over someone you never even dated? Oh, girl. I think at the end of the day, I mean, I've had my fair share of experiences with this. Oh my god. My vision. Being single for two years, talking stages, things happen, you know, and you do tend to sometimes get your hopes up, think someone's gonna be around, turns out they ain't shit. Oh crap, I should have done my eyes first. Eh, whatever. Taking it off after anyway. By the way, oh my god, all over the place. Um, I'm recreating the, I'm re recreating the look that I did for my birthday shoot. You guys better go on my Instagram right now and show me some love on my birthday shoot. I'm planning on posting three posts a total on my birthday, so when you're watching this, go to my IG, show love. But I'm recreating that look today, or attempting to. But anyway, back to the damn question. Kind of exactly what you just said, as harsh as this is about to sound, if you never dated them, why waste any time simping over them? Like, I've just realized being single, I remember like the first time I talked to someone being single after my relationship I got really really down over somebody oh I'm, I'm already not doing my steps correctly but you just gotta be like you know what that wasn't even my man like yeah I had hope yeah like we could have been something great but at the end of the day if they don't want you enough to even claim you they're clearly not even worth stressing over or being in your life at all so as harsh as that is you just have to kind of be like all right whatever and obviously like some situations are deeper than others but I've just learned by being single why waste your time over somebody that wasn't even yours and I think it comes with the territory of being single eventually you learn like not to get your hopes up with people and to not think that you're the only one because trust me <laughs> most of the time you ain't and I think finally after two years being single I really am at the point where I don't give a crap like the whole hot girl summer shit I don't know I really my friends tell me I act like a boy I did give my all to someone in a relationship before and I'm so proud of myself for all the growth that I've had. Oh my god, I can't. Look, do you see this? I can't multitask. So at the end of the day, why am I gonna give that same energy and lose myself over somebody that was not mine? Oh crap, I have to pee. And the shit show begins. Hold up. Can I hold it? No, I can't. Hold on. <laughs> all right. I'm back. Yo! Oh my god. But yeah, enough about this question. Enough about boys. Ugh, like, we don't need them. They're truly so replaceable. I'll talk about boys in another video, but honestly, I will share this. One promise I made to myself was that I would stay single until I turned 21. And a few people did not like to hear that. But my mindset, and that doesn't mean that I'm not going to be wholesome still. It simply means I want to go to the damn clubs without having to worry to respond to nobody. I want to do what the hell I want. Go out with my friends as much as I want and just live my 21st experience period and honestly if you're single and your 21st is coming up I recommend you do the same damn thing because my ugh, crap. my mentality was why am I going to look back at my 21st birthday which you only live once and be like damn I didn't live it to the fullest because I was worried about so-and-so and so-and-so -and -so might not even be in your damn life anymore I don't know maybe maybe I have this attitude because of things that I've been through but whatever by the way my brother Brows are terrible. Don't mind me because I can't even do my brows when I'm sober to, to be honest. So. Next vacations after Las Vegas and Miami. To be honest, I'm pretty sure it's just going to be because after Miami, I have to go back to school. Semester starts. Oh my god, I, I haven't even fully accepted that my finals are over. But I'm going to go home to New York for three weeks in March. I already booked my ticket. I'm so excited. What kind of drunk are you? <laughs> 
Okay, I feel bad because I'm doing this video and I feel like you guys can't even like experience drunk Adiel to the full potential. Obviously, I'm not like, I'm buzzed, but I'm not, I wouldn't say I'm drunk. I mean, maybe I am. I don't know. <laughs> I can't. But I would say I'm definitely very lit. I'm kind of very obnoxious. It's kind of like normal Adiel, but times 10. I'm not really an emotional drunk. I'm definitely the twerking drunk. I'm low-key kind of shy normally. And when I'm drunk, that all goes out the door. Drunk Adio is pretty savage. She's pretty bold. Yeah, and I don't get angry. There's only one time that someone got me angry. But we're not going to talk about that today. And usually I remember things. I'm never blacked out. Of course, sometimes things will be like a puzzle. But I try and remember my limit. How, how do you stop yourself from drunk texting? And no cap, I, I really mean this. I've never been like a drunk texter. I mean, okay, there's been a few times, don't get me wrong, where I'll send like drunk texts, but they won't be like extravagant. Me trying to see if I'm being a hypocrite right now. Let me put it this way. This is why I feel this way. I feel like being drunk and drunk texting is an excuse to say things that you want to say when sober, but you can just blame it on the fact Blame it on the a a a a a alcohol. So if I drunk text someone, it's mostly because I was thinking about doing it or saying something when I was sober. But I was like, what if they take it the wrong way? So let me just say it when I'm drunk, you know? But I've never like woken up to random texts that I didn't remember sending. Like I always, even if everything's kind of fuzzy, I always kind of know what I'm doing. I never really regret any drunk text because it's stuff that I wanted to say already if that makes sense well right now i just can't bear the shots so i'm gonna mix some alcohol in my tea because i love this tea and i'm probably not gonna like it anymore after this video i'm totally letting my concealer just set too i think that's the last question i'm gonna answer now i'm gonna go into a story time my friends at school surprised me today and i've never been surprised like that before like ever the one time that i kind of have been surprised is oh my god i'm not gonna pour a lot guys i'm not acting like i am i just i can't that was like one and a half shots maybe i don't know now this is what i can work with i have this problem where like my mind will know there's liquor in something even if i don't taste it strong and i won't let myself drink it hold up i want to actually drink some. why am i like this i can't do this. honey i got a big storm coming <sighs> okay <laughs> i'm getting drunk hold on, hold on, hold on. If I have to triple check something, <laughs> that means I'm not so worried. So, hold on. Let me drink a little more racing. But what was I just talking about? Oh, one time I've been surprised before was... Well, it technically wasn't a surprise because I was told about it beforehand. But when I was moving to California, one of my best friends in New York got me like a California flag. And yeah, they were gonna surprise me, but then there was like a situation that happened with that, so they had told me beforehand. And that's that on that. But today, I literally walked into my 8.30 a.m. class, and like there's like a window into the door, and I saw 21 balloons. But for some reason, first of all, I was half asleep. And I opened the door. Like, I wish someone recorded my face, because I was like, like, I was trying to remember low-key if it was someone else's birthday because I just couldn't believe- I didn't believe that they were gonna surprise me. So they got me balloons and cupcakes and they got me bottles. And it was the cutest thing ever! And I found out that they- So one of our teachers would do icebreakers. I'm like taking forever. Hold on. Wait, let me like- I'm gonna mad at myself because I'm taking- freaking forever um oh why am i being so rough so our teacher does icebreakers they told me that a few weeks ago they've been planning this for like two three weeks i guess they asked the teacher if they if he look if he could ask the class like if we were a cake what flavor would we be and of course my freaking extra ass like i didn't think anything of it but my extra ass was like, I would be confetti cake with like pink frosting and sprinkles and like a ring on top. And everyone was cracking up and turns out they were probably cracking up because that was the cake they were trying to get me. And they were like, well, damn. But they literally, well, I ate the pink one. They made me one pink one for me. It was so cute. They did that and then my friend Pearl. Shout out to Veronica Pearl and Shira because I'm pretty sure they were the main ones involved. I mean, shout out to the whole class, obviously, but I'm gonna put that footage in my birthday vlog. Dude, I, 
I can't have full conversations right now. Hold on. I'm gonna start putting on music. But, um, 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 um. Oh, Pearl texted me asking me, like, for bottle recommendations for her friend. For her friend's 21st. And I thought nothing of it, but she was actually trying to find out my favorite bottles. And I told her about the beatbox, and she told me today, she was like, I looked at my phone, and I was like, what the hell is a beatbox? Ew, this blend. Okay, I'm gonna put on some, uh, this playlist on SoundCloud. That's really late. Go, Shawty. It's your birthday. Hey, hey. I'm just trying to hit it by the end of the night. If you were talking about 98 babies hat and my Capricorn. Us Capricorn 98 babies had to wait all damn year for this. The December one. Oh my god, no. Ew, this is ugly. So then I did a black a black liner. A black eyeshadow smoky liner. So let's attempt this. It's probably gonna look ugly. Oh hey. Oh, oh my god, my face is fantastic. No! What am I doing? Dude! Bad bitches, only bad bitches. How did this even happen? I mean, I know how this happened. I'm not, I'm not able to create straight lines. The lashes will make it okay. But how? This happened. Hold on. I don't I don't think you guys understand. How did I manage to do this? Oh my god. Ew, why am I doing this? Alright, well, this is as good as it's gonna get. <sighs> yeah, don't do this at home. No. Either I'm really that drunk or flavors one is no longer on SoundCloud. No way. Okay, I swear it's not on here. That's fucking ratchet. Girl, what's wrong? Why you won't leave him? Cause bitch. I swear, you put music on when you're even the slightest bit lit and it, it does the damn job. Alright, but this is the scary part because I'm about to put on my lashes. I look like Voldemort. Is that how you say his name? Voldemort? Voldemort? I don't know. I don't care. These lashes, they're already pretty dusty. I have glitter all over them. I just want to know. Yeah, it's my 21st birthday, but you know what? How are you? It's fine. December 23rd, Monday. Wow, turning 21 on a Monday. Tonight, I'm going to gay bars in West Hollywood. I'm talking as if I'm going right now. Right now, I'm going to sleep, but when you're watching this tonight, that's what I'm doing. I got an email. Who trying to talk? It's 11. 30 at night. No, it's not. It's 12 11. It's almost 12 30 at night. Um, which eyes which don't know Don't care. Can't really be asked to be honest. I thought I would be done by now I mean, this is pretty appropriate 21st birthday glam. I mean, what else do you really expect? Should I attempt to waterline my eye? Let's do it. I kind of want a cupcake. We'll do that too. Pearl, if you're watching this, God bless you. Can't even take the wrapper off, but you have my heart. We lit, we live. Ew, why did I make it so long? Oh no, oh no. No, I don't care how buzzed drunk I am. I will not listen to EDM. I'm so sorry if that offends anyone. I just cannot. Unlimited rewards, including 5% back at I can't find the fluffy powder brush I literally just had. Oh my god! It's right. I dropped. We got cupcakes, we got liquor, and we got the powder I just dropped. Oh my god! You know what? We gonna put my lipstick on. I used candy K in the shoe. And then on top, I put like a purple LA girl lip gloss for the second outfit. I know I'm drunk and all, but even when I'm drunk, I know this is freaking terrible. I look so cakey and bad. Thank God I didn't film this on my real birthday. You know what? Sober Adiel was looking out for myself. No setting spray can undo this cakey, gross, blotchy mess. I can't. All right. Well, what time is it? It's 12.24. Wow. Wait, I think the last time I looked at my phone, it was 12.11. 
The past 15 minutes have gone by so slow. I swear to God, I thought it was going to be 1 a.m. I hope you guys are um, entertained. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed me struggle and me all over the place. Stay tuned for my 21st birthday vlog because I am going to vlog or try to vlog, attempt to vlog, hopefully I remember, vlog at the club and um, to also vlog on my birthday trips so you guys can really experience drunk at y'all. I feel like this setting, like I've never done my makeup drunk so I don't know. I don't know if you got the full vibe. To see how this makeup look really look, go to my Instagram. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you all so much and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye everyone.